Welcome, I'm Kevin Smack. Nice to meet you. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. Smack that subscribe button, really appreciate it. We are growing every day and would love to see you around. Let's go and just get right into the video. If you are stuck on your load screen in Fortnite, there are some new ways to fix this. Then I needed to do an updated video, so this is it. So hope you enjoy it. I will mention things about console later in the video. So if you're PC, you want to watch the beginning. If you're console, you could probably skip down below. I'm sure someone will put a timestamp to where that is if I don't myself. So let's go ahead and just jump in. First thing you want to do is if you are using NVIDIA software, sometimes it can cause problems. So on your keyboard, you want to hold Control, Shift, and Escape and it should bring up this menu here. What you're looking for is going down to NVIDIA and you will probably have three items like I have here. So you wanna click on it and you wanna end task. And same with the other two, end task, and then end task. If you're not seeing this, you wanna make sure you're in process and if it says here, if it says more detail, click on that and it'll show up there. So it should be gone. Sometimes they restart, sometimes they don't. If they restart, that's fine. That should still fix the problem. So now you just wanna go ahead and try the game again and see if it's working for you. If it's not, you're gonna to wanna to try the next few fixes. But a lot of times that works if you have Nvidia. So if you don't have an Nvidia graphics card, just skip this part and go right to the next one. If this does work for you, let me know down below that it did, just so I know with more positivity that's working for more people than just myself. So the Epic Launcher has changed. So it does start you off in store. Just go ahead and click on home and you should see Fortnite here. You don't wanna launch it, you wanna actually click view. So here, this is something you're gonna do that will take some time, just so you're aware. So you wanna click here and you wanna choose verify. What that's gonna do is verify all your files and make sure all your files are in order. This will help a lot and make sure the game runs smoothly for you. I always recommend to do this if you're having any problems at all. So make sure you run a verify. There are some other things you can do like running CCleaner and also defragmenting your drive. I do have another video that talks more about that. I just kind of want to get briefly to the fixes. I want this to be a short video, but I'll link the other one up here. If you if these don't work for, for PC, then you want to follow that video for the other items. So let's go ahead and talk about console. I'm talking about PS4, Xbox, and the Switch. With that, you don't have the option of verifying your settings like you do here you just pretty much can get into the game. So first thing you wanna do is check your consoles, make sure you're not out of space. If you're out of space, you're gonna to wanna to delete some games and make more room. By deleting some games, you will clear up space and your systems will run better. If this doesn't work, you wanna make sure you're also restarting your device. Some people are putting like PS4 in rest mode and they never turn it off. You need to turn them off at least once a week. And if you're having problems, it's always good to turn it off and then start it fresh to make sure it comes up. That way it has more power, more processing power, and it's ready to go, and it'll help get through these load screens. Now, everything I'm saying may not fix it. It will only help on your side. If it's an issue with Fortnite itself, you might get past it, but at the same time, you may not because they may need to fix things on their side or in the code. So these are the things that I've recommended so far. Something else you could do on console, which does take more time and I kind of consider it like a last straw. Like if you have no other options and nothing's working, you're gonna wanna make sure you remember your login information for the game and you wanna delete the game. Delete the game completely. Once it's deleted on your console, restart your console. Once it's back up, download the game again set it back up and then you're good you should be good to go if it is on your side that should fix it basically that's like verifying the files but since you can't do that on consoles because they make them hidden so you don't mess with it so you just have to delete the game and kind of put it back on 
So I hope these fix your load screens and you are crushing it. This is for season, season seven. So there will be updates as we go because all the time Fortnite is evolving. So I will keep these videos coming. So I hope this worked for you and I hope it's loading faster. Thank you so much for being here. If you have any other questions, check out these videos. I'm going to put two more videos up. The one that I was talking about and also another one if you're having problems with graphics loading. Both of these kind of go hand in hand with this. So I'll put those up now. And thanks so much for being here. I'll see you in the next one. Smash